guys are tired. Yeah. Yeah. No questions. I'm good. <laughs> I know you've talked about how you're feeling earlier, but how yeah. the pickup games kind of been able for you to test everything that you've been going through? Yeah, the pickup games have been great. Um, so thankful that we had a bunch of guys that were in the facility early in September. Um, for me, that was the first time that I played five on five, and um, you know, there's nothing like playing basketball. So there's nothing like uh, doing, you know, just in-game stuff that you can't get from drills. You're, you're guarding somebody, you're reacting, you're, you're getting a rebound and trying to go straight back up with it. Like those things, I, I can't really practice. So to have the ability to do that was was really big for me. Hey. Gordon, a little, a little over a year ago, you, you and Kyrie talked about how you had kind of talked about playing together for such a long period of time, and yeah. it's finally going to happen. Lasted about five minutes right. in the regular season. Um, what have the conversations been like, and what's some of the anticipation about hopefully getting a much longer run together this year? Yeah, very similar to last year, yeah. to be honest. Um, you know, it's uh, it was it was very difficult to have to watch most of the well, basically the whole year last year. Um, and then I watched it with watched the playoffs with him too, so I know it was hard for him uh, to sit there as a competitor. It's you know the last thing that you want to do is just to be forced up onto the sideline. Um, but I think that gave you know some of the other guys on the team just invaluable experience, and uh, we're both looking you know looking excited to this year and can't wait to get started. I'm sure you had no idea how how good Tim was going to be a year ago at this time. How the expectations you think changed for this team this year after watching his progress and even Jalen? Right. Jared. Yeah, yeah. No, I think all three of those guys, um, like I was just saying, I mean, I think you can't teach experience. And for them to have that playoff experience, go through the whole year, and then in the playoffs have even more responsibility with Kyrie being out. Like, um, I mean, you could argue they're more experienced than I am going to the Eastern Conference Finals. And uh, that's that's great for our team. And there's going to be situations where uh, somebody's going to get hurt again, somebody's going to be sick, somebody's going to have be ha having a bad game. And uh, as as it does to every team throughout the year, and for us to have so many guys that we can rely on, that can go get a bucket, that can get a big time stop, like that's huge for us as a team. And um, you know, I think that probably is why we have so much expectation on us. Um, but I think. You know, we're ready for it. We're ready for those challenges. Can you expand a little bit on that as far as like the pickup games that you guys are having now? Uh, having played a little bit with those guys leading up to last season, do you notice a difference with some of the young guys like a Tatum, like a Brown now versus when you were kind of playing with them before the season started last year? Yeah, I mean, they're definitely more confident. Um, so sometimes in pickup games, like, um, you know, not everybody is, is making moves or, or really trying to score, but we have people across the board that you can you know, isolate, that can create their own shot, create a shot for others. And you can see some of that in the pickup games. Like guys are just more confident. Um, not only confident in themselves, but as, as a teammate, you're confident when you pass it to them, like they're gonna get you a good look or they're gonna make something happen. So um, yeah, I think it's, just, it's a confidence thing. Uh, Gordon, uh, how, you, how you doing, man? How you doing? Uh, one of your great strengths is that you're uh, able to do it individually, but also complementary. Uh, how do you see yourself fitting in with the group if you're watching and now you've played with them for a while? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, I've always been a basketball player that has done a little bit of everything and done whatever the coach needs me to do. Yeah. Um, and I mean, I plan on doing that same type of thing for our team this year. Um, I think because of you know the talent that we have, like it's not going to necessarily be the same every single game. I think some days it might be for me to score, some days it might be for me to play make, some days it might be for me to defend, um, and rebound, and start the break. I mean, there's there's lots of different roles that I can play, and I'm willing to do whatever, um, so that way we can accomplish what we want to accomplish. Gordon, can you talk about your uh, over here? Can you talk about the process of you coming back, like being on the court now? As you're going to start training, you know, what your mindset's going to be? Are you going to have to sort of chain yourself to be cautious, and or are you just going to let loose? I mean, what's it going to be like? Yes, yeah, so, I mean, I think more than anything, um, I'm going to. I mean, first off, I'm going to uh, follow the progression that the staff has set out for me. I think whatever that is, if it's um, you know maybe taking certain 
days off or rest days or whatever. I haven't necessarily talked with them yet on how that's going to work, but you know, first I'm going to follow that. But secondly, if, you know, once they, which they have, once they tell me I can go and do whatever, I'm just going to go at it full speed. I think that's what I have to do. I have to just, um, you know, jump right into it. I, I think there's going to be, you know, hiccups along the way. There's going to be things that, you know, I'm going to get beat defensively. I'm going to make a mistake offensively and. I think when you don't play basketball for a year, like those things happen, and that's the part that I have to, I have to find my rhythm, find my groove a little bit. And I think the pickup games that we've had have been good for that. Um, you know, there's still only been like four or five times I've played. So preseason, coming into the season, like I'm still going to be trying to find my way a little bit, and I think that's fine. But I'm going to have to go at that and just attack it. Do you feel like you have something to prove? I mean, you're a veteran. You've been in this league a long time, but. With all that happened last year, do you feel like you have something to prove here and to these guys? Um, I mean, I don't think that I necessarily have anything to prove, but I think internally I always want to be the best version of myself. Um, before last year, I'd improved as a player every single year I've been in the league, and so that's something that I'm proud of, and I put a lot of time and, and work into the offseason to try to improve my game. And so the only thing that I have to prove is, is, is to myself, like just make sure that I go out there and give it my best and, and play my hardest. Last question here. Gordon, um, since you guys have so many veterans, is it kind of left unsaid that you guys are going to have to sacrifice minutes? Like you said, maybe one night your role will change. Will that, is that unsaid? Or will there be kind of a meeting between everybody to say, hey, we've got to have this chemistry. We, it has to be done for the team's success. Yeah, I mean, I think we've started those conversations already. Coach Stevens has talked to us about it. But I think the beauty of it is if guys have been asked this question already and, and we all have said the same thing. Like we all want to win the, the whole thing. Um, that's our goal. I think we all realize that if we have team success, individual success will come too. And I think, you know, that's kind of been that's that's my mindset. I think that's a lot of the guys' mindsets and so I don't think that's something that we have to worry about. Thank you, Gordon. Thanks guys.